Imagine a day at work where your computer isn't just a tool but a partner that knows exactly what you need before you even ask. This is not just a dream, it's the reality with Microsoft Copilot. Picture a tool so advanced, it's like having a personal assistant who's always one step ahead, making your daily task easier and more enjoyable. Since its introduction, Copilot has revolutionized how over a million people work, boosting their productivity by an incredible 30%. It's not just about getting tasks done faster, it's about working smarter and unlocking a level of creativity we never knew we had. Microsoft Copilot isn't just another piece of software, it's a glimpse into a future where our interactions with technology are seamless and intuitive. From crafting the perfect email to generating comprehensive reports in a fraction of the time, Copilot has turned the mundane into the extraordinary. It's not just changing how we work, it's transforming our relationship with technology making it feel more human, more understanding and a lot more helpful. Join us as we embark on this exciting journey with Copilot where every day is an opportunity to explore the limitless possibilities of working alongside artificial intelligence, making our work life not just easier but truly inspiring. Craving a career upgrade? Subscribe, like and comment below. Dive into the link in the description to fast track your ambitions. Whether you're making a switch or aiming higher, Simply Learn has your back. And before we commence, guys, just a quick info for you. If you're one of the aspiring AI and ML enthusiasts looking for online training and graduating from the best universities, or a professional who elicits to switch careers in AI and ML by learning from the experts, then try giving a shot to Simply Learn's postgraduate program in AI and ML in collaboration with Purdue University and IBM. You can find the course link in the description box and pin comment. So let's get started. So guys, this is the Microsoft Copilot on the screen. And you could see that Microsoft Copilot is an innovative Gen AI tool that offers a versatile and user-friendly experience across various platforms. And there are three ways to access it. That is first directly within Windows and then the Edge browser and as a standalone web tool accessible via Bing or any dedicated website or browser. So you could see here, this is the icon. So this is for the Copilot only. And if we open the Edge browser, you will get an icon here. So here also you can access it. Or else you could search on the web. That is Copilot. And you will get it here only. So you could see, we have clicked on the first thing and here is a Microsoft Copilot. And for Windows 11 users, Copilot can be quickly accessed through an icon that is next to the search box. As you can see here, that is the Copilot pre version. And this provides a persistent right hand pan for seamless multitasking. And in Edge, Copilot enhances browsing with a dedicated pane for immediate assistance, featuring advanced functionalities like web page summarization. Additionally, anyone can utilize Copilot via Bing or any web portal, requiring only a Microsoft ID for access and is compatible with multiple browsers on Windows and Mac OS. So this broad accessibility caters to diverse user preferences and workflows, making Copilot a highly adaptable AI assistant. And if we talk about its features, or first we'll see the Pro version, that is Copilot Pro. So here you could see that, that the Microsoft Copilot Pro, it's available for individuals or the creators and power users looking to opt for Copilot Pro. So you could have it for 2000 rupees per user per month. So as I'm assessing the website from India, you could see the amount in rupees and we convert into dollars. So the dollar amount is $20 per month and you could use the free version of Copilot and then we have the Copilot for businesses. And in India, the pricing varies from around 2495 and that too you have to give an annual commitment. And the price in dollars is around $30 per month. And for that also you have to give the annual commitment. So let's have an overview or let's get back to Copilot Pro. So you could see that you would get the answers faster with the Copilot Pro. You can unlock Copilot in your favorite apps. That is, you could experience it in Word, Excel, PowerPoint and Outlook in a whole new way with built-in Copilot features. So with the Copilot basic version or the free version, you won't be having the accessible version in all these apps. But with the Copilot Pro, you could have it. 
and you can create and design better than ever that is you could create images that is a way more enhanced and informative than the free version and this tool also uses the DALI 3 and you have the 100 daily boost with designer and here is the comparison between the copilot and the copilot pro so in this the copilot you could have access to the gpt4 and gpt4 turbo during known peak times whereas in copilot pro you have the access to gpt4 and gpt4 turbo even during peak hours that is for the faster performance and here you could use copilot for the web in windows mac os and ipad os and you could use text voice and images in conversational search and you can create and edit ai images with 15 boost per day with designer and you could use plugins and gpts and if we talk about the copilot pro you have the gpt4 and gpt4 turbo with all the times and then we have individual needs and interest you could use the gpts own copilot gpts and then we have the productivity apps like word excel powerpoint and outlook you could integrate the copilot in that if you have the pro version and you could generate unique images that we have already talked about and here you could see that they have given us the experience AI in Word, Excel, PowerPoint and Outlook like never before. So this was about an overview of the Copilot. So let's move and have a hands on Copilot. We'll run some prompts and see what we can do with the Copilot. So let's start with the summarization and we will open the Simply Learn website for articles and ask Copilot to summarize it for us. So we have the software development articles. Okay, the front end one. We'll copy the link and get back to Copilot and ask him. So it has already starting giving us the summary of it. And now we can ask him, can you summarize the article provided in the link so you could see that it has provided the summarization in a very concise manner you could also ask him that you could provide us that provide this in around 400 words or 300 words so the copilot will do that for you and like you could use it for the more creative version that is this is best for genetic imaginative responses such as drafting marketing copy or brainstorming ideas that is not ideal for work related tasks or you could use it for more precise version that is you could ask him to deliver concise fact focused responses suitable for tasks requiring state forward information we have different versions also for the copilot uh, as you could see there's a conversational style so the more creative version is best for generating imaginative responses such as drafting marketing op or brainstorming ideas that is not ideal for work related tasks so first talk about more balanced version so this offers a mix of creative and precise responses and that is useful for planning or seeking recommendations and then comes the more precise one that delivers concise fact focused responses suitable for tasks requiring straightforward information so you would see or use accordingly and we have created a web page summary now we'll ask him to create a first draft so first we will ask him to draft an email so copilot can assist in crafting initial drafts for various documents like emails or marketing pitches that allows customization in terms of tone format and english so here we will ask him write a first draft for an email for asking you group manager to to provide permission to install coffee machine so let's see you would see that the copilot has started generating the response and for the first draft of the email he has provided us the subject then the dear group manager name and i hope this email finds you well and i am writing to request 
permission for the installation of a coffee machine and here are the key points supporting this request and then the proposed coffee machine options so these are the options that could be installed and then the implementation plan like if approved we approach or we propose placing the coffee machine in the common area that if the proposal gets approved you could have an area dedicated for the coffee machine so you could see that how beautifully it has crafted the response and then you could use another feature that is you could insert images add an image here so let's search for an image and ask him so we'll search for tower of pisa and let's ask him about that so we will copy an image for that copy the image and let's paste it here okay it's not taking as a paste so we have to upload it so let's head back there and we'll save this in the downloads and in the articles we'll name it as tower of pisa that is a jpeg image let's go back to copilot and we'll upload the image here moving to the downloads articles the tower of pisa and let's ask the copilot can you describe what is depicted in the image and if there is something famous about it so let's see how well the copilot respond to us so you could see that it's analyzing the image so here is the response generated by the copilot that is design and purpose so the leaning tower pisa is the campanile free standing bell tower so it has recognized the image and provided that it is the tower of pisa only and the height and the width and its weight and the history and lean and the architectural controversy so you could see that it has very well recognized the image and provided all the information about it so using copilot can initially be somewhat airy but its response are often human like so you could see that it has provided us a very good responses during the summarization process or drafting an email or just recognizing an image this was about the free version so you could provide prompts to the copilot and it will work for you and here's one thing that you shouldn't be fooled by the copilot's hallucination because copilot appears to be all seeing all knowing font of information and able to pull out the most are key facts on request but that's not the case in truth it's most like a not always reliable because it's a self taught polymath who when converted with a question he can't answer so it can make something up in order to appear more knowledgeable than he really is so keep that in mind and don't blindly trust the copilot and then we have to check for the copilot plagiarism because what it provides is not fully plagiarism free so you have to keep that also in mind and you could also generate the images with the microsoft image creator and that is a very good function if you have the copilot pro version so with that guys we have come to the end of this session and i hope you guys will find the prompts for the copilot and use it and see how well it respond to you so if you like this video please like share and subscribe if you have any questions comment down in the comment section below till then stay safe and keep learning hi there if you like this video subscribe to the simply learn youtube channel and click here to watch similar videos to nerd up and get certified click here